Hello everyone, my name is Megasan Fjord and today I will show you a video. This, is, this will be a tutorial how to install latest warp on your Samsung Galaxy device, in this case Galaxy S4, or, or any Android device. So with this, with the help of Twarp, you will be able to install any or flash, any ROM, mega backup, restore, or anything else what you want. So guys, uh, here's just uh, information that this is Android 7.1.1. So you can see it clearly here. Uh, well, it's in Lithuanian language, so, but Anyway, I'll make, a, I'll show you as a proof that this is, yeah, here we go. So what you have to do, you have to install or uh, this application and it's called Warp Official App. Okay, so Let's search for better internet, then let's here hit him and then search for Twarp. So here we go, this official Twarp application and uh, it looks like this and you just install that. You can see, uh, basically guys, for this application you don't need root, but, but the most important thing that you will not be able to make some you will not be able to access few features so make sure that you have rooted device otherwise you will not be able to use many of its features so okay we see that it's installed we click on that and here we go this is the actual view official twerp app and uh, it's okay I have very bad lighting so we'll come here so um, this is uh, that what you have to do it's like uh, tick on a I agree because you agree that this device might also be bricked and it, it can be also very heavily bricked so next step is you tick run with root permissions because you must have this Okay, just click on that and click on this. And if you want to, you also can support uh, in any way uh, this warp application, enable network statistics. But uh, so this is the view, the main menu. Now make sure that you click on warp flash. And this is and this is the popped up notification that you have to uh, get access for this uh, root application so we see that application got rooted so first of all then select the device in this case this is galaxy s4 but take a look how many options you have with the galaxy s4 for example so make sure that you carefully look what model you have this is very important thing because Whenever you flash something, it's very important. So, in this case, this is international model, but you can see a little bit see Exyn, Exynos, and Qualcomm. So, in my case, this is Qualcomm. Okay, so make sure that you download the latest file. You can both download, uh, I'll show you that, image star or image. So, Let's click on this one. Wow. Okay, so now you just click download twarp 3.0 from point two zero. Okay. And then you allow the program to be downloaded. And it's done. So you can see it's this is really light software so once it's downloaded so just guys i want to show you that you will not be able to open it when you click on that so it shows that it doesn't open 
So we can see that the current device is Galaxy S4. This is just a shortcut, GFLTEXX. So now select a file. So it's in download. Okay, so I just click on this one. I'll just tick, select that one file. And what we would do next is, um, guys, do not uh, just make sure that you click on the right button. So um, uh, I recommend just to do what I do. Do not do otherwise because it might cause any some problems. So, um, so what you have to do is flash to recovery. Do not flash to boot. Do not click this one. This one, just click flash to recovery. And do you really want to flash SD card to recovery? And of course you click OK. So basically uh, this software lacks some of the features. Just before doing that, um, I will show this application in a detailed view so we can get into settings. Just a second. Oh no. So this app can be run without root but most Features will not be available without root, as I told you before. So run with the root permissions and nothing else. So also can update this application. I think that with the newer version, it will be able just to download the, the file directly on this, um, on this application. Or if, you, if it will be downloaded, so you just click on that and it will be um, just the, this this picture will boot up immediately, will show up immediately. So, um, so what do we do next? We have the file, we've done everything. Okay, no file to flash. Okay, we have again to, to show it. Just click, select, and then flash to recovery. So here we go. Flash completely done so uh, basically guys this is it so what do you have to do next you just will have to um, restart your device just click on the restart um, to, 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 just restart and uh, of course um, I will make a restart just I'm doing that you know I can also just shut it down and then go to recovery mode immediately but um, I will not be doing this because it might be not be very useful to do so okay it took a little bit longer so I better just sit just better restart my device and then without any worries without anxiety I will just Put the device shut down, I will put it down and then go into recovery mode by clicking um, some buttons. So, so volume button, uh, home button and then power button. So we can clearly see. It's really beautiful put up. And you can see this kind of... Uh, uh, I showed you how I... Okay, I'll show you how I installed this uh, ROM. This is really nice ROM. It's working. It's it's it it working really fluently, and uh, I really like the Android 7.1. It's it's really it's really fast. It's really it has so many features that you can guys imagine, you know. And you can see how fluently it's working. It's really working really fluently. So guys, okay. So let's put it down. Okay, so device is putting down. Okay, now I'll just click on the volume up, home button, and power up. And let's try again. And once you hear, okay, I will just do it again. So if it doesn't succeed, just remove your battery. 
and just make sure that after you make a restart so just click on volume up home button and and just wait a little bit just a little bit wait okay let's do it again Okay, so guys, after clicking volume up, home button and the power button, you can see that the device is going into recovery. So, and now, wow, we have a team win recovery project and uh, it's 3.04.2-0 which is the latest one so guys you have a lot of things here so just make sure to back up your device and uh, just swipe to backup also um you can do many many things here like installing like for example you want to install something just click on this and blah 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 so really nice also if you want to wipe your system also, do not afraid, this is really nice thing, you can also put any files when you are not even using uh, your phone, when it's turned off. So anyway, you still will be able to put files into this um, twarp project, or T V R P. yeah. So guys, uh, thank you for watching and I hope that you enjoyed the video. If you have any questions or just, just comment below and... Um, if you like this video just click like and uh, do not forget to subscribe to my video so peace out